Now, what's interesting of note here is that the search query volume is showing 1,600, which, um, which I believe that they're doing on a, a weekly or a monthly basis. Uh, it's not really abundantly clear, but I'm going to say weekly. Um, and in here, you'll notice this number is significantly smaller than the suggested search volume right here, which they're defining as the estimated number of times this keyword is searched monthly. So if we times 1,600 by four, it's nowhere nearly the size of 62,000. So you do have to take these volumes with a grain of salt. Uh, this data in the search query performance report inside of Seller Central is directly from Amazon. We believe these numbers to be the Bible, directly accurate. So when you're doing your keyword product research, you're gonna wanna take these, these numbers as gospel. Um, however, when you're starting a new product, you won't have access to these. So you should definitely consider using these as the baseline as you get started. Now, Helium believes the trend is up 186% right now, but their data could very well be off. There could be a reason why they see a spike, but, but Amazon doesn't. So right here, you'll see this is the data set for July 3rd to July 9th of 2022. And, and this is um, sorted already by the value of the search query, the value of how much important this keyword is to my brand. Now, one of the most frequently common questions I get asked about this report is, can I download it? The answer is no. Unfortunately, not yet in 2022. I think that'll probably change here probably in the next three to six months. Another common question I get is, can I... Um, understand this keyword down to the ASIN level or the particular product? And the answer to that is, unfortunately, no. You only get this data at the brand level. 